Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how you can integrate Localizer with your Webflow platform. So the first thing you need to do is log into Webflow. You can see here I'm already logged in and then you need to click on your site that you want to integrate Localizer with. So I've just got a custom one or example one set up here. Um, so while that's loading up, you need to go to the Localizer website. So this is slightly different than the integrations we've done already in that Webflow have actually given us a custom JavaScript code that we can use with their platform. So uh, I'll include the link to this integration guide where you can get the code um, on the description of the video. So once you're here, you copy the code like so. Go back to your dashboard for Webflow so it's just loaded up there and in the top left hand corner where where you see the W just click on that and hit site settings so in the site settings screen you need to look for the custom code tab so there's a series of options here you can see them and custom code is the one you're looking for so once you're in custom code scroll down to where it says head code and the add head code at the end of the head tag so what you need to do then is click in this box and paste in your JavaScript code that you've copied earlier. So once that's pasted in there, you hit save changes. And that's pretty much it. You're ready to start uh, localizing your Webflow platform. And um, you can see here that my plan isn't, isn't actually, uh, doesn't actually have the capability to, to do so um, because it's only a trial plan. I haven't um, confirmed my email address or anything. Those are the steps for when you actually have a, a proper plan set up. Um, again, I will put the link to the integration guide in the description of this video. And if you need any further help, um, simply go to our website and find our contact details um, there.